power on. This is an HP Pavilion A1630N. At the boot screen, I'm pressing F10. Oops, I pressed F11. Escape. Let's try this again. Boot screen F10 for system recovery options. I'm going to hit escape on this screen. Don't know what that is. Windows 7 is selected. I'm pressing F8 for advanced options. I'm going to do repair your computer. This, by the way, is a Windows Media Center PC, which had Windows 7 loaded on it, uh, an unlicensed copy of Windows 7. So it um, needs to be removed. And I believe that since Windows 7 was installed, that it destroyed the, uh, the options or whatever data is necessary to be on the hard drive to cleanly get into the, uh, the HP recovery program. So I am walking through the steps of, uh, of starting the recovery from the intact recovery partition. Word. We're going to go to Command Prompt. We're going to go to the D drive, which is the recovery partition. I'm going to list hidden directories, and what, what I want is in mini NT, I think. And then, it's in system 32. Oops, I don't want all that. There are a lot of executables in this directory, and one of them is the one I want. Oh, I don't have this sorted by name. Let's do this. Okay, so restore.exe is the name of the uh, of the file that I want. Restore.exe, enter. That launches the HP recovery program. <clears throat> um, I believe there are some shortcut keys that you can use on this screen that'll do some different things. I don't remember what they are, but I also don't need them right now, so I'm just going to initiate the recovery, start PC recovery, hit next, hit OK. I'm going to go to advanced options because the PC recovery in this normal default mode of operation will not delete any data files that you created. But well, we want to wipe this out because I've already backed up all the data on this computer. So I want a destructive recovery, which is what is selected. Hit next. Hard drive is going to be reformatted. Yes. And it is underway. I may continue to capture some of this. I don't suspect this will be a particularly quick process. So actually I'm going to I'm going to pause it here and come back. So we have a progress bar with elapsed time and time remaining. All done. Clicking restart. But it's not restarting. Anything. The one I had before. Why are you fussing for daddy? You change it too. Oh, and look what I got. It's Please hold. Okay. 
It's a big eraser, huh? Please don't whine. 